Hello everybody and welcome to another video here. This day we're gonna be doing something rather different because uh, we haven't got enough up, uh, enough material for the next update video on the sim current simulator. But we're gonna be looking at our simulator we won um, cockpit tour that we recorded last summer, a long time ago, but we never got up to um, uploading it on YouTube. So we're gonna be taking a look at it. I think it's pretty funny and we showcase the simulator, talk about it and <laughs> mess around a little. So I think you will enjoy this and uh, we'll be hopefully next week, as soon as possible, uploading the next update. Maybe on the electronics, maybe on the pedal encasing or something to that uh, extent. But hopefully you will enjoy this as well. I think it's really good, really funny and you can see a little bit uh, what you can expect after this new simulator is up. So thank you for coming here and then go and enjoy this video as well. Welcome to the flight. We are here flying to uh, Madrid from Lisbon, Portugal. And uh, this is the 737-800 cockpit. Yes, hi. Um, we have made this ourselves yep. in like three years. Or more than three years. Yeah, yeah so. like this This thing is old boy. Yeah. But it, it works, kind, kind of. It works, kind of. Uh, kind of. Don't look at this. Yeah. Here is the door that you come in, you can't really see it. Oh, hold on, hold on. Here is the light, so we can turn on some lights here, yeah. like this. Uh, there's the flight computer. Yeah. There, and we just know. running the main monitors of the game. Here you can see that. Uh, second officer seat, or uh, just it's quite ugly, but yeah, it works. It works very well. Um, well yeah, yeah. Um, there's this job. We are oh. currently climbing to our cruising altitude, but we have to disable that yoke thing. Yeah, so it doesn't interfere with the uh, but, but, but we can uh, uh, control the uh, rudder. Yeah, look what happens when you push the rudder. Oh, oh shit! So, yeah. and what's our flight time? Flight it... time is, well, our time is 52 minutes and block time 1 hour 20. And we should arrive at 18.50 local, uh, Zulu time actually. Yeah. Uh, here you can see the main instrument panel and everything here. Yeah. Um, the main panels run on uh, Simwim. Or <laughs> what it's called? No, there's uh, the, real sim control. Yeah, yeah, yeah something. Yeah, I, I don't know. But yeah. Formerly uh, sim vim, but now yeah. it's the shit version. It it kind of works nice, but it lags a lot. <laughs> yeah, this doesn't work in, in sim vim at all. This is custom code with uh, some some uh, li code library, but I don't remember what it is. Yeah. yeah. But it is good boy. Yeah. It's 3D printed. It's kind of motorized, but the motors don't work. <laughs> yeah. yeah, because um yeah, they didn't work so well, so we just got them off. Yeah. Here you can see the first of the radio panels. They are work in progress, but probably will never be finished. <laughs> yeah. And it uh, they would have gotten backlighting, but we have done it because they are in progress. Yeah, they would be really fast to just put the strip there and yeah. <laughs> it would be done, but I don't know why we haven't done it. It would be here. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We can adjust the lights right here, like in the real plane, over there and over here, but I'll cut here. But this is very blinding, so yeah. don't use them at all. Yeah. The backlighting only, is... Only if we need to read something at night. Yeah, like the uh, flight log that we have over here. You can see our uh, flights here. We have done so far, how many flights is this? Eight? Eight yeah. flights, I Eight. think. And this is the ninth flight. Yeah. And yeah. And I think it, oh yeah, here is the steering wheel. And here is our uh, iPad where we can read the data and we have Maps running here, so we can see we are uh, over there. 
out over there actually. And you can see all the taxi taxi instructions here. Here it is Navigraph. Guys, do you know a fun thing you can do in planes? <laughs> what? Okay. Manual control. <laughs> Just don't break the plane. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh shit. Fuck it. No. I just need to straighten just like. Oh no, there we are. Yeah. There we go. I don't know if these. I think these are on. Uh, yeah, they're on. I can. Do yeah. this so, so you can kind of see better the uh, lights here. Yeah. But when you turn this on, you can actually read what they say. So we use this. Yeah, it's very nice. It works very nice. Yeah. But yeah, here you can also see Alnav and uh, Vinavis on. Yeah. Um, let me see. Our next waypoint we will be at 18:05. Zulu time. So about 20 minutes, uh, 25, 26 minutes. Yeah, 26 minutes. And it is 163 nautical miles. Yeah, so it's pretty straight line. To straight yeah, it, it was basically directly from the runway to the uh, arrival. So, yeah, very nice. Uh, first officer lands the plane. Oh, really? I'm oh, you. okay. Well, the plane can fly itself, and the first officer can have some sleep. And beer. Oh, uh, <laughs> got that. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. I'm gonna call some flight attendant. Uh, do we have... Oh, is it, is it this? Oh, oh could be. Uh, um, could be. Well, we have some pressurization problems, but... Nah. I don't worry about those. Can you we turn... Can <laughs> <laughs> we can... <laughs> Can it turn some uh, uh, air conditioning on? Yeah. It's getting quite hot. I don't. It's worth like twenty seven. Yeah. We have uh, air coming out of the uh, simulator. Yeah. Can you feel it? Can Can you? Yeah. Can you, you can feel it. Too, yeah. Too. Yeah. You can feel it easily. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Good. Yeah. So just chilling here. Chilling here in thirty degree <laughs> <laughs> sauna. Yeah. You see the wet compass is. Working quite nice. It is pointing to 60 degrees, and now actually hitting is 73. But it's a slight variation. Only a slight. Let's call it magnetic deviation. Exactly. Yeah. Okay, so Thank I think. Thank you for watching our 737800 simulator um, showcase. And thank you so much on behalf of me as well. Um, although the video was quite old, and the new sim uh, the old simulator doesn't even exist anymore. I think it was still a fun throwback looking at that flight and that uh, showcase. We were just taxiing in after the flight. Um, anyway, I would like to thank everyone so much for the support we have received. Like, getting over 100 subscribers while we are like 140 right now. That is insane. I would never have thought that we have, would have grown so fast. It's really, really amazing. I thank you everyone for your support. And we hope to continue this series for a very long time. And we hope that the outcome is going to be really great. And well, we know it's going to be great. So stay tuned for updates in the future. And I'll try to work as hard as I can on bringing you the best possible updates. And just thank you again. And we'll see you on the next episode. Bye bye.